thank you abdul and uh, it's a honor to be with you and just to give you the overall journey in healthcare specifically from tata group perspective we started off in 2015 uh, when there was a major challenge or came to our notice in all india institute of medical science where patients used to take minimum 2 days to see a doctor for 2 minutes and aims looked at it and wanted to bring in a technology solution to solve the problem by putting emr and other system in place so we looked at that problem in a very different manner when we did a major analysis in aim we spent about one and a half months almost morning 3 am to 4 pm every day watching and observing what is happening in aim without looking at any solutions or problem need issues challenges we were just observing based on our observation we realized the biggest challenge in aim was confidence no patient has confidence to see that the system will take care the doctors and other health professionals in aim they are also not confident because of overwhelming nature of number of patients so we came up with a very very unique method of solving this confidence problem by removing confusion we establish clarity once you have clarity automatically the confidence disappears for it confidence emerges and confusion disappears which gave us a con- for us a confidence that we can really make a big impact in health care this particular initiative our honorable prime minister recognized as the best digital india project in 2015 subsequently we started looking at a very innovative method of solving health care problem health care problem is of multiple nature but i will give you one fundamental problem of our country health care which is access most of the technology innovation last 25 30 years if you look at it it is always assumed when a patient is with a doctor either in a clinic or in a ward or in a procedure room or in an operation room but actually the majority of the problem is to get the patient to a doctor when we talk about in this country about 1 is to 1800 one doctor for 1800 people that seems to be a statistical number but that is true in a city like delhi mumbai chennai kolkata bangalore ramadabad when you go little from far from the city that ratio goes very high that to given the various specialization neurology urology nephrology cardiology like this if you go then this ratio becomes very high just to give you i don't think we have a one doctor for every four or five lakh people for a mental illness in this country so this is the access problem as a country we face so as tata we emerged into a various different thought process we created various thought process now a chairman came up with an idea called digital model he also wrote a book about it uh, it's called a digital nation we kind of come up came up with a solution which is highly pertinent to healthcare but digital model is useful for more other industries also other industries we want to coach systems and various other education other areas but healthcare it is prominent we have done several experiments using the digital model we have worked deeply in cancer care by working with tata memorial hospital in mumbai tata medical center in kolkata cancer institute in adyar chennai regional cancer center in trivandrum close to about more than 1.2 1.3 million cancer patients we solved through a problem called digital now solution called digital now center it created a huge impact in 2017 18 we created another model for public health system to benefit and to the digital now center which is an innovation from tata using the digital now center we did implementation of the concept of our healthcare model in common public health system in kolar in fiber primary and secondary system. 
healthcare, which created a huge impact. We continue to do that project. We also experimented the same thing in Himachal Pradesh in Kulu in Bilaspur. We also did the similar work in Telangana. So the model is working, and based on that model, of course, government of India is taking major initiative on digital health mission and with the national health authority model. We could so we could provide all our experience knowledge to them. In addition to that, we have also developed. In Tata, our own deeper thinking: how we solve the urban care issues of India. In urban India, the biggest problem is the chronic diseases, the lifestyle diseases, hypertension, diabetes, thyroid, psoriasis, PCOD. All of them are a huge issue. And that is, let's let's say, for example, obesity is told that by 2030, obesity will be impacting. Close to about 430 million Indians. It is like about close to 30 to 40 percent of Indians are going to get impacted. Obesity is going up all diseases. It's going to bring in all more all other diseases. So we have developed a very unique methodology to solve this problem, and on the private healthcare model. We are also similarly developed for a rural India. We have developed a model which can work in rural India. And a connected, continuous, proactive healthcare model. See, our principle is very simple: connected, continuous, proactive, close to patient, patient-centric healthcare is the solution to solve the healthcare problem. I'll stop it here. This is on our healthcare services experience as a group. Within Tata Medical and Diagnostics, we embarked in this journey during COVID. We launched the first commercially available CRISPR diagnostics product for COVID. We launched in November 9, 2020. This product we developed from the science. The, the science was developed in IGIB or CSIR lab. We took the science and then converted into a product. Within 100 days, we launched this product, which the world has never heard of. And this product helped to solve a lot of rural COVID testing problems. Because doesn't require an artificial machine, and we created a big impact for that. Subsequently, in Tata Medical and Diagnostics, we developed very very unique COVID testing product, even in artificial. We are the first one to bring extraction free artificial. We are the first one to bring in a fast protocol to do an artificial test within 15 minutes, and we could put all of that in the airport and do very quick results. Then, when the Omicron virus hit the world, we are the first company in the world to come up with a product to solve to identify Omicron virus directly, and which is a patented product from Tata and B. Within three weeks, of course, ICMR has really been work help us and work with us, advise us, and then the product got approved within three four weeks, and we could in the month of end of December we could take the product because number twenty six. Was the first Omicron virus was detected in South Africa. So this is Tata Medical and Diagnostics is in a mission of solving healthcare problem by developing futuristic diagnostic product using science and technology. So as I told you, Tata Medical and Diagnostics is a product development. Manufacturing company, developing futuristic science and technology product to solve a medical or healthcare problem. Currently, Tata Medical and Diagnostics has developed that the indigenous TB product, which is very very unique. We have developed that TB product in a open system. As of now, the TB products are all developed in closed system. We have developed a product in TB and a weapon. That means during COVID, there are a lot of artificial machines were set up. There are more than three thousand labs in the country with available. With the same machine, you will be able to test TB because with the Prime Minister's direction to stop TB program by 2025, to stop all the TB mortalities by 2025. So we are working on supporting that. We are also making a major innovation in. HPV 
human papilloma virus detection and we have developed a very unique indigenous product all of them are an indian company developing this product has not heard of before we are also coming up our focus in tata medical and diagnostics four vertical one is on molecular diagnostics which is the product which i mentioned second immuno diagnostics and immunology we are looking at fluorescent immuno as our focus but using future technology to develop immuno so there are a lot of r&d is happening in clinical chemistry and hematology we are come up with a very very interesting product see most of the product today in clinical chemistry and hematology is in a centralized model which can happen in only in big cities our country's big volume is in rural so close to patient is our mission either a point of care device on which you can easily test in a phc or a primary care centers in private side or even in a local lab in a district lab so we have developed some very very compelling product for clinical chemistry and hematology like this all of this product are scheduled to go to market soon in next two quarters thank you absolutely